Hey, welcome to Brickzar's basement and beyond. Today we're going to do a haul. This is mostly train and slot car related items. If you don't know, I have a channel that I focus mainly on train and toy trains. And that's trains are, and that's what this minifigure is for. And this is Carl. He's the mailman who delivers all of our mail. Yes, he does that for us because he likes us. So this is going to be trains and slot cars. Some may be here on Brickzar's basement. Some may be on trains are fun when we actually do things with them. I really like trains. It's my next passion next to Lego. And we'll start with this box that I believe came from Canada. I think it came from eBay on Canada. Right, we got these well-wrapped <laughs> slot cars. So I will need to get them out of the wrap here. They're well taped up, so let me do that. All right, that was a pain to get those out. He had so much tape on that, but he got here safely, so that's the thing that matters. All right, we got this Highway Patrol. This is from the Tyco U-Turn slot car set. You can always tell the U-Turn cars because the front wheels don't roll. It's got the pin. The wheels are a little dry-rotted. This is a Lamborghini. Now, this is not a U-turn car because the front wheels move. Now, these wheels are dry rotted too. That's, you know, that happens when something's 30 years old. And then this is the, um, I think this is the Ferrari from the same U-turn car set. So, we have this set. Uh, one of the wheels came off the police car. I was actually able to glue it back on with super glue. Seems to be working, but uh, I'd like to get it extra. Right now we'll do this other box, this small box here. Let's see how well packed it is. Right. This is a very critical piece. We have received the Batman box car. This is a Tyco, and I noticed in the picture he was missing a coupler, so that's no big deal. Uh, one thing on these Tyco box cars that's common is for these little steps to be missing on the ladders. They break off with play, but it's got all of them, and he is missing the, uh, the there should be a brake wheel that's missing on the top of there. But what I do is I buy used lots all the time, so it's, it won't be any problem to get a replacement coupler and a replacement wheel. But those are the common things. Uh, the couplers break, the steps break, and the brake um, wheel is missing, but uh, the only thing you, you can't really fix without glue is this. So I'm glad those are all there, but this is Batman Comics Boxcar, 1977. Pretty cool. Alright, next one we'll do the smaller one first. Hendrickson trailer suspension systems, genuine parts. All right, now this one's going to be neat because it's going to actually have the box. This is um, the brown box era of Tyco, which is what I remember. And I remember going into a store called Lionel Play World, and they would have these um, sets and accessories set up and they had these brown Tyco boxes and you, this this one obviously he picked up at a KB for a dollar ninety nine or less but it's Shazam <laughs> it goes with the DC Comics because there were four DC Comics box cars Wonder Woman, Batman, Shazam and Superman and it's Shazam so that's pretty cool getting one that's in the box we'll pull it out and it's got the couplers and this is like in mint condition. But there's the uh, brake wheel. It's on the, the top. So this one, this is a lot more shiny than the Batman one. The Batman's more used. Missing a coupler. But that's Shazam. And we'll do the bigger box. Ah, yes. 
and it is a Thomas and Friends, first of all, from Jeannie's Bargain Mart. <laughs> we have Henry. So this is, I usually would like to do it like as a surprise on Trains Are Fun, which one did I get this month, but now you know. That will be on Trains Are Fun, that's going to be the new Thomas and Friends edition. Henry the Green Engine, says it right there, with moving eyes. Nice. Set him to the side for now. We'll do an unboxing on the or an opening on that. And we also picked up these um, box cars: Woody's Roundup and Buzz Lightyear. I don't know much about these um, Toy Story box cars here. It says they're made in Slav Slavnia. <laughs> they're not Tyco. Um, Got a little more detail actually on them. It almost looks like a refrigerator car in some ways. I'll show you if I can get if I can get Woody Roundup out of the box. <laughs> so that looks like a refrigerator car. That they are compatible with the horn hook couplers with the other box cars. So that is the haul. We got Henry. We got two Toy Story box cars. We got two comic book box cars. I got to add a coupler to that one. We got the Tyco U turn and a regular Tyco slot car. So Thanks for watching this haul here on Brickstar's Basement and Beyond. As I said before, some of these you will see on Trains Are Fun. Some of them you will see here on Brickstar's Basement. You may see all of them. But why don't we, before I go, I'll go ahead and say goodbye, but then I'll put these on a train, these uh, comic, tra uh, comic book boxcars on a train, and that'll be it. So thanks for watching. See you in the next video. It's Brickstar.